Wow. Oh, <laughs> uh -huh. That's totally different. That's so cool. Hey, good cameraman always gets this shot, <laughs> right? See. Let's check it out. All right, look at the head there. See, it's right over the golf ball, both ways. Look at your follow through there. Yes, yeah, much improved. Come on over here. For the kids at home. Oh. <laughs> you can come right over here. Come over here? Yeah, right there. Yeah, that'll work. What do we do? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. You're watching. You're watching this. Oh. Yeah, that's all. So that's wonderful. Foot flare is good. Centered over the ball. Wrist hinging. See how your body's not tilting like it did? Yeah. Yeah. Smoke that thing. Look at the right foot. Pro finish. Up top. Thanks. Go again. This is a Super good. So when you're uh, going back with the backswing, we're just trying to keep you a little bit more centered, right? So I'm gonna help you with that right now. Okay. Yeah. You go ahead and get ready for the ball there. Oops, sorry. So that ball's roughly in the middle, eh? So your goal is sometimes when you go back, you'll go up and you'll extend those arms way up a little bit early. And what happens is your weight starts to go or you start to shift this way. Okay, what I want you to do is start to feel a little bit of hinging, perhaps in this, uh, in the hands a little bit. I don't know if you, sorry, um, feel a little bit of this. I think what you do is you kind of lift it all up in one, one lever, one piece. Yeah. And I want you to start to feel a little swing in the club. Okay, and that's going to help your head stay a little more centered without tilting. Okay. You make, you understand me there? I think so. Yeah. So we'll just go a couple times without the ball. You, you hold on and I'll help move with you. Okay, so we're going to go up and you feel a little bit of this hinging of the hand. So if you waggle the club, right, what does that mean? Well, waggle is usually from wrist joints and a little tiny flex of that back elbow there. You know, you feel that a little bit? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so there, you know, <clears throat> we need to blend this in there with you so that you don't do all of the whole swing like this which is, your swing is really good, but it's, um, it's lifting the arms up all in one piece and sometimes your body starts to look a little like this, mm -hmm. you know, and then as we saw, you're good at shifting back most of the time. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna be better if we can just stay centered with your head over that golf ball with the irons. You get this thing loaded, you get a hold on there? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you do it this time. So you're pretty stiff-wristed there. Yeah. That's the, yeah, you can feel that, right? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I'm definitely breaking my wrist and where I'm usually like this. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. There's a little bit of that. I also think, uh, actually, I know that your right hand grip starts to slide a bit underneath the club. Um, but what I was telling you before, too, is <clears throat> that wrist there. Um, it's a little bit on there underneath the club. See the fingernails are kind of up to the sky? Yeah. Yeah. You want to get those babies a little bit more facing the target. <clears throat> you put it on right there. I think you can see your grip in, in the reflection. Like <clears throat> yeah. Exactly right. Yeah, a little okay. bit. Okay. Um, when, when we did uh, your little grip test, your hand was more right to the side of the club, like shaking hands with the side of the club, you know? Now, these want to be like more towards the... Yeah, 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 just like this. Just like, you know, the crease there is kind of going right up. Yeah, so where you were, you had that thumb wedged yeah. over there, and then you were locking down the wrists uh, somewhat. And so I'm going to show you why this is helpful. You got it right there? Mm -hmm. Is this normal here? This is normal. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Lock you lock them down. Okay, you got it? Mm -hmm. Okay, so with that right hand over, you'll feel a little back of that right wrist bend easier, mm -hmm. right? Where when you're under this way, you can't. Got it. So a little bit of that right hand over is going to help you with the wrist 
step. There you go. That looked easier. Very nice. We're at hand on the top. Look at that thumb over the other side of Adam's on the grip handle. Yep. That's all right. Let your pro come in and help you out there, right? There you go. Soft. Yeah, yeah relax. You got it? Got it. And you start to feel that little bit of suppleness there with the wrist. Okay, we want to feel like you can load the wrists a little bit. So you don't have to do so much work with the whole framework, right? Yeah. And this is really going to help you with your short game. <clears throat> that was really nice. That was like so easy. Right? Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah, good. Good, 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 good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a totally different thing. Yeah. Exciting, huh? Yeah. Yeah. You go. Just stand up. Stand up for one sec. Yeah. Put it out here like this. Good. Just how you kind of organize yourself. You just put it straight out in front of you. It's no big deal. That's so hard. It just used to go in the other way, right? So now you can see how that thumb is over. If Adam's is 12 o'clock on the grip handle, yeah. then your thumb's just chilling out over at 11. Okay. It can be right on the side. You got to get out of the vice grip action. Yeah. <laughs> but now that crease is starting to fold up a little more towards your chin. Relax this elbow out. Yep. And you can move the hand over a little more easily now. This one. With that elbow soft out. Yeah. You got it. There you go. And we'll just push it out in front of you so you can see it. Good. That crease right to you. Okay. Yep. So that's to the side of the grip, just like this, where a lot of tour players are there. Okay. Okay. Yep. And a girl right there. Perfect. And that'll hinge that back of that right wrist. There you go. That was good. Now let that right shoe go through on this this little swing here. Yeah, on the follow through. And I'll come help you in the end. Stay there, stay there. Yeah. Yeah, here's gonna keep going like that. There you go. Yeah. You have a backyard at home? Yeah. Something you can do this kind of stuff? Yeah. Like practice swing? That'd be helpful. So all I did was just yeah, it was more more so that you would complete the swing. Uh, completing the swing would be you facing the target, right shoe up, the back of that tennis shoe facing the people behind you, watching you hit killer shots. <laughs> okay, so that's the deal. Good grip. A little softer hands, elbows soft. Turn it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Does that feel better? Really good. And the head's staying right over now. Yeah, really nice. Yeah. Yeah. Very nice, very nice. Feels different getting over to that left foot, correct? Yeah. It's been flat footed. It was like there's too many things in my head to remember all. <laughs> I just was always like, I can't. Wondering where you should be. The last. You know, I'd concentrated so hard on my arms, I forget about the feet. Grip's good. Heads over the ball. Nice. Wow. Whoa. <laughs> That's totally different. That's so cool. Hey, good cameraman always gets this it's shot, so right? Easy. Let's check it out. <laughs> All right. Look at the head there. See, it's right over the golf ball, both ways. Look at your follow through there. Yes, yeah, much improved. Come on over here. The kids at home. Oh. 
<laughs> you can come right over here. Come over here? Yeah, right there. Yeah, that'll work. What do we do? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. You're watching. You're watching this. Oh. Yeah, that's all. So that's wonderful. Foot flare is good. Centered over the ball. Wrist hinging. See how your body's not tilting like it did? Yeah. Yeah. Smoke that thing. Look hey everybody, what's play. happening? It's Gormanator here. I just want to let you know that I'm Bro doing live finish. Zoom lessons. The next Up best top. thing to an in-person lesson. Go again. Live Zoom. So if you want to kick that slice to the curb, hop in, and let's get going. I've got my launch monitor and the tools I need. If you're at the office, work, wherever, we can get it done. Click the link down below. Hit the page. It'll tell you all about the lesson and how it works. You'll be excited to get it done because I'll take care of you. See you guys on the next video.